The Green Solutions Greenfield is the project. It says that we have a great community first and foremost, but I think everyone understands that we have an obligation to preserve and protect you know, water in our region. The project is located in the Kinnikinnick watershed, and this watershed is prone to flooding and poor water quality. It's a very impervious watershed. So Alverno College came to us a few years ago and said, what can we do as one of the largest green spaces in this watershed to help manage the water a little better for water quality and quantity? And one of the recommendations from that project was if you could capture about 25% of the homes in the area tributary or just upstream from your campus with green infrastructure, with rain barrels or rain gardens, we should be able to really do a lot of good. We went out into the public and said, hey everybody, what do you think about putting in a rain barrel or a rain garden? And many of them said yes. We had 64 rain barrels and 12 rain gardens. We exceeded the number of gallons that we wanted to capture. The project ended up achieving 82,400 gallons. Yeah, that's really kind of hard to believe, isn't it? Um, you know, it's like if I just put a plastic you know, barrel in my backyard, is this really going to do anything? But when 76 people do it, or 100 people, or 1,000 people do it, it really has a significant impact. Green infrastructure is a not so traditional way of managing stormwater. When you can slow the water down and give it a place to hang out for a while after a storm, it doesn't flood somebody downstream right away. It also allows it to get rid of pollutants.